Welcome to DIY Solar Homestead. I want to show you around. No promises. But I'm looking at this house right here. It's beautiful. If you want to make your own electricity, click in the links down below. A solar hot water heater for your swimming pool like I have. And solar hot air. The links are all down there. Uh, but this. I shot a video of it yesterday and it ruined it. So, look at the pole barn. That is amazing. You wouldn't believe. That's got to be more than a 10 car garage. And there's many more surprises. They got hoops over there. They got a nice little concrete spot. Maybe for picnic tables and such. I don't know. They got a swimming pool out there, but my swimming pool won't be that far out. I assure you. And, uh, they got a wall over there. Let me grab the umbrella. There's a wall there. I don't know why. But that would block some of the sunlight, I guess. But imagine. That's south. And I got to show you. It's a solar roof. <laughs> it's not solar yet. But it would be and way back there. Could be the chicken coop and on this side of that chicken coop is a fenced in garden ladies and gentlemen that'll be beautiful but i'm not going to get my hopes up there was a vehicle here yesterday so there's a lot of people looking at this for 75 grand let's see if i can pause this correctly this time now here on the back side of the house that's one big open room I don't know if that's supposed to be the dining room, but I could make it into a grow room. I would get rid of this tree. But I'm out in the woods, basically. We got five acres, providing I get this. So I can see a lot of food forests going on. Looks like some fruit trees right there. And now that I have what do you call that? The cloner. I'm going to be cloning lots and lots of blueberries and goji berries. Black cherry. And I'll probably get some apples in here pretty soon. But look at this garage. This pole barn is amazing. I guess I don't need the umbrella right now. I'm going to drop it. Now look at this back side of that barn. That's beautiful. <laughs> I could hold a lot of solar panels on that. Looks like they were going to provide a power pole here to drop in some wires. Got expensive, but I won't need it. Probably put a birdhouse on it or something. Or a oh, wind generator. Oh, that could be a wind generator. But back here, there's a fenced in garden. To keep the deer out. Barn. Okay, here's the back barn. It's not a big barn, but they had two types of animals out here. So that's really cool. I would probably make it one pen and extend it way out. So it would be more like free range chickens, goats. Look at all that yard. I got five acres here, providing I get it. You can cross your fingers, but look, this is the only place that I can find so far that I can have solar. So I could put probably right here. Take it right here. Look at all that free firewood. It's not too far from the shed. And the trees are right there. So, I get great sunlight in the summertime. Maybe not so great in the winter. Those are a little tall, but I'm not worried about it. I would have free electricity going in here. I would only need a few lights. So, that would be amazing. I love it. I still don't know what that wall is right there. Maybe they were going to fence in a larger garden. 
because I started to build a fence over here, a great big railroad tie fence. But yeah, this is this is beautiful. 75 folks. So I oh five five and a half thousand on my house. Looks like I need a new fence on part of it. So um this is 75. I'm gonna get 40 for mine. So yeah, what is that? 35, I owe five, 40. I'll need a truck with a blade. Now imagine that, a truck with a blade. Maybe I get one for 10,000. So, put me back up around 50 thou. That's fine, I can do that. <laughs> so, maybe I should say my prayers. <laughs> I didn't drop the umbrella. I got it with me. This would be beautiful. I could put, with a cloner, I could probably have 30, 30 uh, blueberry, 30 goji berry, all kinds of apple trees and peaches and, wow, this would be amazing. Oh, sunshiny days, even on a rainy day, because I have solar. <laughs> I'm ranting. <laughs> so yeah, this is spectacular. And I only have to drop a couple trees. They're huge, so I'd have firewood forever. And over on this side, I would probably plant tons of trees right through there, all the way along that, that fence line right through there. So, so I'd always have firewood. I grow my own heat. These are beautiful. That one's already down. That'd last me a couple years, I bet. That's, these are in front of the barn solar array. So, <laughs> they would have to come down, providing, probably have three or four years of firewood right there. Meanwhile, I'd have saplings growing along the side for the future events. So, this whole place right here could be all garden, or free range, chickens and such. But, if we can cross our fingers, we can prepare and go to the bank tomorrow. Uh, hopefully somebody calls me or I call them about this. I want to I wanna see inside the pole barn. It does have a smokestack. I have a wood stove in my garage, so I got a plan to prepare. I got to do some numbers, crunch the magic. Right now, you think I, I kept the umbrella? I'm gonna go find a mom and pop restaurant somewhere and have breakfast. Yeah, I would love to have this as a homestead. The barn is too far away from the house, and the chicken coop is too far out. But you know what? This is the best I found so far out of 30 houses. <laughs> this is the only one that will provide uh, solar power. So, whew, I'm stoked. I'm happy. Oh, and the biggest thing of all, it's one story. Now that I'm 54. <laughs> but yeah, this here is beautiful because then I can continue the, the ordeal to set up a wood shop so I can make furniture and I can have Wesley's garage gym. I can have my own corner for the uh, solar workbench as well as the workbench for uh, fixing vehicles. So everything that I've ever wanted. But if not here, there will be another one sometime soon. But <laughs> lots of dreams. All right, I'm ranting. <laughs> Is that nine minutes? <laughs> All right, you guys have a solar sunshiny day.